Hello. How are you guys doing today? Good. Wow, so many phones. And so I was, I'll ask you the same question that I asked Grady, just to kind of hear your reaction. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, it's been a couple years since the Falcons have really been in this position this late in the season. Now, yeah. Foyer taking nothing away from yes, you motivated for every game, but how much more motivated are you to know that this deep in the season, this team still has a chance to get to the postseason? Uh, a lot of people put it into perspective for me. Uh, you know, it's still young and earlier in my career than some of the other guys in the in the building. But really, you never know when you're going to get this this chance again. So a lot of guys have been, you know, playing on teams in the NFL and really have never been in this position. So uh, really, got to take advantage of any time you can make the playoff, any time you can smell that playoff berth because you never know what could happen in the playoff. So when you get in this uh, this window of opportunity, we definitely got to take advantage of it. So that just makes it, you know, every more important, every practice out here that we can't let it slip away. So that's kind of how we're playing, how we're practicing that this is a really important uh, game coming up. Any thoughts on being second in the league and tackling there? You know, there, it's ups and downs. You know, a lot of, depending on who you ask, I, I enjoy it because I feel like I'm being productive for my team and I'm getting, uh, you know, a lot of times I'm making the extra effort, getting to the ball, making tackles. Obviously, I want to make more plays on the ball, but, um, in terms of sometimes how I'm playing, I feel like I'm playing good. But some people will tell you that, you know, it's not a not a great step. But, you know, depending on who you ask, I feel like it's, a, it's an uplifting thing for me. But it's always better, more I can do, uh, better plays I can do, better run fits I can do, uh, just helping my team win. So, um, yeah, just trying to win, man. Okay. That's all. One more time, I like, zoned up. Just like the physicality of this game, with the way that Cam Newton is kind of like, he, he, he doesn't shy away from getting hit, I feel mm -mm. like, a lot of times. So I was just kind of curious what you think about in terms of the physicality of what this game is. The, the last game we played them was physical. They definitely wanted to make a point to run the ball on us. So kind of with Cam back there, they got another running element. And I think we have a lot to prove on, uh, you know, getting off the field. Uh, if they do want to try to run it on us, uh, making sure they can't do that so we can get the ball back to our offense to have them you know, put as many points in the, on, the, on the board as possible. Um, it's going to definitely be a physical game like last time, and they came on the winning end of it. So we're going to try to win this one. We're talking to Dean, and Pete kind of said, when you do this long enough, it, it kind of turns into when you play teams again, it's like, we know we had your number in this way, so we want to see if you can fix it. Mm -hmm. said, so we fully are expecting the run. Is yep. that kind of how you look that at would it? be yeah I mean if I was ever a coach and I just beat a team I'm gonna try to do what I did last time to beat them again so I'm expecting to run I'm expecting you know some tempo or whatever but um, you know make them do what they didn't do on us last time so make sure you stop the run okay. Thank you. Thank you.